have no support for each other. Exactly. And Unless you start, they've been involved. Then they gotta talk. That's what I'm trying to tell you. If you ain't been involved in it, you know what I'm saying, you be you you, you really pretty much it's hard because you nigga put you in a bag, a trick bag. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't never seen you did it, and I'm like, nah, let me, nah, he ain't about that shit. You bugging? Because I never seen you do it around me. But then when the tape come out, I'm like, oh shit. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Mm. How do you feel when people, you hear people just say this all the time, that Hove was a part of Illuminati and that... Basically, when, That's you hear, what I was wondering, when you hear so. that, because you hear that a lot, the God thing, the symbols, him and Beyonce and the kids, it, all kind of things are out there. Like when you hear that and then you hear him say, you know what I'm saying? He say on that song, he talk about the, uh, talk about the Illuminati, like that's some nigga shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. He personally. Speaking, he play on it. What I do play, know is they, hustle, they ain't come made me an offer. <laughs> That's all I'm telling you that. Would you take is it that, if they did? No, nah, nah, man. <laughs> no, nah, I doubt it. I don't know what the oath is or what also it is. Also, it's just depending. Huh? It's just depending on nah, what Nah, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I, I, I know what I'm a part of. I'm a part of uh, God. You know what I'm saying? I, that's what part I am. Like, if it, if it don't have nothing to do with God, <laughs> no got nothing to do with church and, and me finding my purpose and, this, that's, and doing all of that, nah, I know that. That's not a that's not a part of God over there, and mm -hmm. we see that. So wow. let me ask you this question: So, um, have you ever met um, Jaguar Wright? Uh, no. Nah. No. Yeah, but we talk. I ain't meet her in person. Oh, but you but spoke me and her to her. Has, me and her has conversations before. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I was watching one of the interviews where um, they were talking, and she was like, "Yeah, she wanted to talk to you, you know, off Person, air, yeah, personally yeah. off air." So I didn't know if y'all yeah, actually I, got know, a man, chance. I to think she's uh, dope. No. Um, it's funny how you mention her name, right? She she just started speaking about that, right? Since mm -hmm. I probably told her about my story right. probably a year ago, a year and a half ago, right? So listen, so dope ass story, and it's crazy because this girl just reached out to me in my DM before, just not too long ago, right? She says, hey, you, I don't know if you remember me, but we hung out together in South Carolina. I think we went to a show, a concert, whatever, this and that, and the third. And I was like, oh shit, I do remember you. You know what I'm saying? So I hit her back. Yeah, I remember you um, because I rented, you know, back then I uh, had a little connect with Chris Lighty. And he was 50 manager then. Okay. So, you know, I, I rented a limo to drive to the House of Blues from North Carolina to South Carolina to see the show. And, and, and when I got there, when I seen the show and everything, and I met her, and she wasn't lying. So we went out, I hung out with her. She had a friend. Um, we met Chris Thomas from the DC, the, the, the mayor, the co comedian guy. We all hung out together. But anyway, she was like, you know, you remember me? She even said, you know, I came here uh, to meet you in a rally a few times. That's where I had a crib at at that time. And she was like, we, we had a relationship. And I'm like, well, that part I don't remember. <laughs> it's ironic, but I don't remember that part, mm -hmm. but I remember the, everything up to there. But long story short, when we was talking just not too long ago, she was just like, yo, you know, I remember everything you told me back then about you, how you and Jay had a bad, you know, y'all broke up, this, that. And this is, I'm telling you, this is back in South Carolina. This is no longer, not too long after the uh, me and Dame fallout. Dame fallout, like, yeah. So she said, I remember all of that. She said, then how I found you is I heard Jaguar Wright said something about De Haven, <laughs> right? Wow. Like she said, I heard Johnny West say something about De Haven and Jay Z story. And then she was like, wow, you know, the fact that I told her this story back then. Right. And Jaguar doing, saying this right now, is like, it solidifies, like, mm -hmm. yo, you know, it, it, people, if you be on Jaguar line, and they'd be like, this bitch is crazy. This bitch is crazy, but she, the girl like, no, she ain't crazy. He told me this 25 years ago. Wow. You get what I'm saying? Wow. So, you know, I'd be like, yo, these people just think, you know, sometimes Jaguar goes, she just, she's just being Jaguar. Yeah, a lot you of know? people are um, believing her a lot more now, especially after the P. Diddy situation. Yeah, exactly, when that exactly. came out and everything came out to be. And my next step is actually meet with her, man, because like part of it, I got some dope shit I'm trying to do with this music. 
and she is super, super still talented. Oh, yeah, and she shit, talented. You know what I'm saying? I, uh, that's my 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 connection with her and shit. A lot of people think like, yo, we gonna get together and do some Jay Z bashing. Yeah, I'm like, nah, you know what I'm saying? Me and uh, Jaguar on a different agenda with the Jay Z shit, but I definitely want to work with her with the music and shit because she's mm -hmm. dope still. Do you fear? I, mean, I ain't gonna say fear. Uh, when it come down to Jay and like I said, the Diddy stuff and him being around Diddy, like what's my fear? That's what I'm saying. Like he's your boy, though. There's, there's, I mean, you you don't yeah, want to see nothing it. bad happen to him. No, nah, I don't want to see nothing bad happen to him. But you, you know. see what I'm saying? Because there was a lot of cameras over there. Yeah, I you know what I'm saying? They said it was 200 and something. I you know. You understand? I what? can't. Um, how do I explain that? Like, <laughs> uh, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like because he's not saying anything about the a, whole situation. He's, he's been, been very, real quiet, very quiet, quiet, really, reserved, right? yeah. real reserved. No, but, uh, that's all of them, though. It's it, not just Jay. It's, it's a all bunch of them. Of it's a bunch of them, bro. They do that. Why do you think they, 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 so they, they It's this, almost like, listen, when niggas got knocked off with your work, and they'd be like, wasn't they got picked up? How was you feeling? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You say, it wasn't they got picked up. You say, wait a minute, who? And what else? You know what I'm saying? You Related know, to the streets like that, yeah. it makes sense, right? Yeah, you just got to like, like niggas that. ain't talking niggas to him right now. Niggas ain't talking like that. They're like, damn, I used to f did I call that nigga? Did I call him on my phone? Did I call him on who phone? Who phone? Did he call me? They be like the feds or the feds? You, start, you be trying to you figure out what the trying to f shit out, and then you try to stay away from shit. That's I just all they wait doing. it out to see what happens. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But, it you seemed, know, but as a person though that was rocking with somebody, the they don't have that, no support for each other. Exactly, and unless you start, they've been involved. Then they gotta talk. That's what I'm trying to tell you. If you ain't been involved in it, you know what I'm saying, you be you, you, you really pretty much, it's hard because you nigga put you in a bag, a trick bag. You know what I'm saying? If I ain't never seen you did it, and I'm like, nah, let me, nah, he ain't about that shit. You bugging? Because I never seen you do it around me. But then when the tape come out, I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I just said, you know what I mean? So if you ain't been around it, though, you can support him. Cause now it changes. It goes, yo, man, man, my my man dealing with something. You know what I'm saying? He has a sickness. You know what I'm saying? But if you saw it and you didn't do nothing about it, you you know what's going on. Mm -hmm. You was around it. You ain't try to stop it. That's why I'm like, yo, you know how many people that have not tried to stop? You think they ain't seen that? You know how many niggas out there whooping ass today? It's a lot Period. Of that you know how many girls? Do you know how much confidence that these girls about to get? Because <laughs> dudes been in doing that shit now. Nah, that's just never been a part of. My but a people. lot of people, even like Raven Simone, came out and say, you know, everybody know about this. Every this is the thing that everybody talk about. Yeah, everybody everybody do knew. Know it, but they keep quiet. Right? Is that mind your business shit? Like I don't know how that shit works, bro. But one thing I do know, they know who to do that shit with. Because it couldn't have been my daughter. No. It couldn't have been my niece. It couldn't have been. That's why I don't be understanding. Like, do these women have any males in their life? Russell Simmons. Serious. Mm. Russell Simmons say uh, it's a lot of a lot of memes and stuff being sent to him by a lot of people who if they if it wasn't for Diddy, they wouldn't even have a career. They talking down now. But he says, Russell Simmons says, Cause he just went through. Yeah, some he stuff. wouldn't have a real career, right? He's so, saying without Diddy, you niggas would. Y'all saying all this out? negative they stuff. Have a but at what they cost? have a career, but what did they do? Right, what did they have to cost? do to get it? That's why. Mm -hmm. Damn, you know what I'm saying? They can't come out. Cause what at did what I have cost? to do? Right. You can't sit and tell me, yo. You know what I'm saying? I, you looked out for me, but you been. You know, I had to. What I had to do to get it from you. You made me do this. You made me do that. So that's why they send so bad why, memes so now. Like, that's why it's a flip script to that when you say, when uh, Russell Simmons say, yo, a lot of people got their careers off Diddy, but what did they have to do? That, that's what you don't know. No, you don't know. You know what I'm saying? Some so, of the stories you're hearing is <laughs> coming out. That's what the ones that's good. coming out. It's not so that's good. that's why you should mind your business, Russell, because you shouldn't be talking. You shouldn't be talking. You just went through something. You know, some things you're going to have to hush up on, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah, don't try to defend somebody for doing something. Yo, you're not there. He, I think he probably just thought about how he just went through his thing. I think he won his thing. I don't and know. And I'm quite sure people made careers off him, but that don't yeah that they don't still justify yeah they still you, they, 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 do, they don't justify what you done was right. Don't justify it at all. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, bro, it's so many people nowadays, man. My DM beef so full of like, bro, you was right, bro. 
Yo, yo, it's a blessing that you ain't no part over there with Jay and them, or you ain't no part of that industry shit. And uh, that all of them is motivation to me. All that confirms me that, yo, you know, I've been new this anyway after a while. God had a different plan Come for on me, now. bro. He had a hedge of protection around you. You know what I'm saying? You think I, he was he was protecting? Yo, know, he protect me. He put the right angels around me. He put everything around me to put me where I'm at today to understand that you know what God, you're right because I I don't I don't see that like, I don't agree with none of that that goes on over there. So that it just it just meant for me to be doing something else. Yeah, we on boss talk one on one. Yeah, we gonna talk.